Howdy folks, Charlie here from Christmas on Crestline. Thanks for tuning in and thanks for tuning in to a tutorial episode. Uh, today we're going to talk about StreamYard, which is what I use for my YouTube channel, uh, Christmas on Crestline. It's what I use for my live episodes. And today I'm going to show you how to put a video intro into the beginning of your lives. If you're one of my normal subscribers, you're used to tuning in and seeing me build props for my animated Christmas light show, or I'm reviewing and testing Christmas lights, or we're talking about how to sequence a song for an animated Christmas light show, doing all that kind of stuff. Today, I'm gonna pull the curtain back a little bit. You get to see behind the scenes actions. And if you're tuning in just to see how this tutorial goes, let me get to it. Uh, so I use StreamYard for my lives. And it took me a while to figure out how to how to put a video my video intro that you just saw actually in the beginning of this episode uh, into my live episodes. So I'm gonna show you real quick. Now here I am in StreamYard. Uh, so here we have my Christmas on Crestline uh, uh, brand. That's just what people are gonna see when they come in and tune into the live, or if they're in the waiting room to tune into the live. That's what they're gonna see. Uh, I do not want to come down here and add myself to the stream yet. I want to come over here and I want to go to the overlays and I want to hit upload. So we're going to hit upload. I'm going to go in here to a video that I call the bat signal. Going to take about 60 to uh, about 60 seconds for that to pop up. Uh, so what are your limitations? Well overlays are custom graphics on top of your stream. Uh, use a PNG or a GIF with a transparent background so you don't cover yourself. You can even upload short video clips. Perfect for intro and outros. The recommended size is 1280 by 720, which is exactly what YouTube already uses. The max file size might get you, so pay attention to this. 10 megabyte for images, 3 megabyte for GIFs, and 30 megabyte for videos, with a max video length of 30 seconds. Uh, if memory serves, they are looking at uh, increasing that to 60 seconds, but it's not there yet. Uh, the StreamYard guys are phenomenal. If you haven't tuned in they, uh, to their Sunday lives, they do Sunday's live episodes uh, every Sunday. And here it just popped up. So, uh, they, I'm sorry, real quick, they do a live episode every Sunday in their town hall meetings. And it's the two owners uh, of the company. You can get on there, you can ask them anything you like. So, for intro and outro videos, we just uploaded one. So, the subscriber in the uh, waiting room is going to see the brand right here, Christmas on Crestline. Uh, I'm not going to come over here and add myself just yet. I'm going to come over here. I'm going to hit click show. That'll take about two seconds and pop. <music> Boom. That's completed. I'm going to click hide. Come over here and I'm going to add myself to the stream. And boom. There we are. We are now live with a, uh, an episode of Christmas on Crestline, should I want to uh, do that. So, there you go, boom, hi. So how do you get rid of that? Well, you're gonna come up here, you're gonna click the X, and it's super triple, simple, boom, delete. And that is now gone forever. That is how you add your intro or outro video uh, to StreamYard. Should that be something that you're interested in doing and using for your lives, by all means, boom, there you go. If you have any questions about how to do that, leave it down in the comments below. Uh, appreciate you guys. Thanks for tuning in. A little behind the scenes action for you. I'm Charlie. I'll see you in the next video, guys.